Hey, you got Fox here. Today we got a dual review of Kelvin Benjamin's Motivator card, 90 overall, so not his newest, and Jack Doyle. These are kind of two cards people don't really search for, I guess, but uh, guys I had in the squad, I just want to kind of give my impressions of how they played for me over time. Um, this card has 88 speed, 91 catch. This bet catch bonus, you know, adding on top of uh, his 93, he'll be a 95 overall with it. So speed stats, nothing great. I mean, that's slower than a lot of linebackers right now. Um, catching traffic, 93. So he's got good catching stats, but not the speed stuff. So really he's not going to like, uh, I don't know, how, how do you say it? Make a lot of people miss, get downfield quickly. He's going to be a catch it and drop type of guy. By drop, I mean to the floor. Uh, but like deep outs, deep um, anything, he's not going to get there fast enough before the pass rush gets home really right now. That me just trying his spec catch in traffic. Just uh, giving it a what for. See what goes. But like, there's a lot better guys than Benjamin on a drag. Like, I know that's going to happen to a lot of guys. They're going to drag it and then uh, t get tackled right away because the, mo the moves in this game aren't very great. Like, his his specialty will be going to the corner there. He didn't get – he didn't was able, wasn't able to get his uh, feet in bounds. Um, he does have a nice big body, which is something I really enjoy by wide receivers. And, I mean, this Kelvin card, it is a card you can win games behind. You're going you're gonna to watch him bail my butt out. Uh, maybe this next play or so. And right there, making guys miss. This play, fourth and nine. Watch this bailout here. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I tested his user threw right at him. And Kelvo just, you know, bailed about. Like, look, and then this play, double block. Like, so you can easily win games with these lower cards. He's only going for 20K. Uh, Kelvin Benjamin, I, I would recommend pick it up if pick him up if you want a good run blocker and big body to throw passes too. I like that card. Jack Doyle. Six foot six. He's also a motivator. They were both on my motivator squad. That's why I'm reviewing them. Um, 82 speed. Ooh, 86 run block. Good. Uh, 90 catching. 87 route running and 95 catching traffic. That catching gets boosted up to 92, and that'll boost catching for all your receivers and even on defense. So that's that's kind of a uh, cool boost there. Same one on Marvin Harrison. I, I don't know if I'm going to do one on him because he's not auctionable. Uh, but scrolling down the stats, you know, jumping's only at 78, but six foot six. But I've I've heard theories on um, tight ends sometimes over jumping on high point passes and leaving themselves open to shots from safety. So it's better to be nearer to the ground and and put your arms up and catch it because you can get to the ground quicker. Basically, you don't get that high animation. Um, so there we are. We'll just go to the ground right there for Doyle. But I want I want to say this guy, pretty good. A little bit of a vacuum cleaner. I think bigger body guys maybe be able to take shots better, um, hits better. Obviously, they fall down and fall forward better, and we've kind of shown that in Madden 16 and 17 with the trucking backs to kind of fall forward a little bit better. But he does seem to be able to hang on to balls at 267. Uh, there's a nice little high point there. 267, he can take a shot, uh, but that is his biggest issue right there. Like, that may have been six if that's like Vernon Davis or something. Uh, because being able to you know streak down the field with his 90 plus speed is a little bit different. There's his run blocking there off the right. I don't know if you guys could focus on that in time. Um, he's sitting on the right side there. He's now he's doing a little corner route. He doesn't have the 96 route running, so those out routes aren't as uh, glitchy as it could be. But oh my goodness, yeah, he does a nice little uh, Marshawn Lynch impression there by trucking. He's only got 75 truck, but of course he plays above it uh, just because of how big he is. So uh, another good budget guy. I, I I don't know if I'd recommend him. He's 65k for a slow tight end. It's good run blocking and uh, his boost is really nice. But Madden is based on speed and neither one of these have it in bunches. But uh, decent budget cards, um, good boosts for you. Can do some things and you can win behind them. And for that, I'm gonna give Kelvin an eight and Jack a 7.5 for being too pricey. Thanks for watching. Call the action. I'll see you tomorrow.